just me again, taking a walk around Lawn Hagler. I decided to not go all the way around today, just because of time. But as I turned around and started walking, I'm thinking, God, this is so incredibly beautiful. And there's just pockets of this beauty all over that so often we don't really even know it's here. And it made me realize that there's pockets of beauty everywhere in our life. And when we live somewhere for a very long time, that being also our bodies that we've lived in for a very long time, we fail to see the beauty that is right in front of us. I know I struggle with seeing the beauty that is in front of me. Um, externally, no, I share all the beautiful pictures I take and all the beautiful things I see. And I share those things with everybody um, constantly. And it's not to just share them with you to tell you like, hey, look at this cool picture I took. It's really a reminder to myself and hopefully a reminder to everybody else out there that the beauty in this world is right in front of us. And we just need to open our eyes. Just go around the corner. Just look at that silly little weed or cobweb and really just notice the beauty of it. The work that it took to make it. So what I'm trying to practice right now is seeing the beauty within and externally on myself. As I've aged, you know, there's things about my body, there's things about my external appearance that I struggle with. And I compare myself to others all the time. And I think, wow, if only I'll be happy when I get here. If only when I look like this, I'll do that. And I realize that's a very unhealthy aspect. And there's no one to blame but myself. In all reality, we are the ones that make the choices and see the beauty for what it is. If we can see it externally in others and, and also in our environment, why can't we see it for ourselves? So that's my message today. It's gonna to be a long video. Hopefully you've watched it. And if not, those that needed to see it saw it and take stock in where you're at in your life and what you've been through in your life. And look in the mirror and appreciate the beauty that's there. Appreciate every wrinkle, every line, every freckle, every mark. Because without those marks, you would just be starting over. You wouldn't have lived what you've lived and you wouldn't be where you're at. I'm thankful every day for being able to wake up and be in this world. Our time is very limited and many of us have experienced people or loved ones, animals, family members crossing. And it's a sad experience, but know that life is short and what we should be doing is enjoying the moments we have instead of waiting for the perfect time for something. The perfect time is now. Take charge, do it, love yourself. Peace out, have a great Saturday.